Ben, any word on Vic? His doctors say he's improving. The skin grafts are gonna take a while to heal, though. When will he be on his feet? It's hard to say. Thanks for keeping tabs on him. No problem. Thanks, Grim. I'll let you know if anything changes. Sarah, you have to do something for me. What is it? What's wrong? Listen, someone from Vic's company is on his way over right now. I need you to let him look out for you. What's going on? Someone's after me now? Why me? I'm saying the people behind the blacklist know who I am, which means they know who you are, and I want you to be safe. That ship sailed a while ago, Dad. All right, then the bodyguards. But you're gonna end this, right, Dad? As soon as I can. I love you. Pretty sure I love you too. Damage report. Hey, hey Briggs. That was a hell of a ride back in Mexico. Is Ollie okay? He's in the medical bay. He'll be fine. How are you old enough? Honestly, I'm a little concerned about what Nuri said. The city is targeting us. That Sadiq knows everything about us. Nice work, Briggs. I'll catch up with you later, Sam. Have a good one. Hey, Sam. Grim tells me you think the cartel are behind the runway attack. Yeah. I mean, it's a possibility. Why? One of my contacts told me there's a bounty on our plane. I figured they were looking to collect. Mexico, drug cartel, you know. There's something you're not telling me? <laughs> Come on, Sam. You think you're the only one that gets hunches? That's all for now. Okay, cool. You need anything, just say the word. Dropping me from 30,000 feet. Nuri sends his regards. Christ, you're bad for business. That's all for now. Yeah, busy man, off to save the world. Try not screwing up any more of my business connections, will you? if Ollie needs anything. Apart from some cosmetic damage, it looks like the plane is fine. It's good to hear. Charlie. What? Any update on that hijacked ship we're after? I'm still working on it. They named the attack American Fuel. A loaded tanker would make one hell of a weapon. What the hell just happened? Don't look at me. Grim. The SMI isn't responding. I'm locked out. Charlie? I'm trying a workaround. Briggs, you got anything? Nothing. All I got is lighting and internal comms. This is the flight deck. We're losing engine power. How long can we glide? We're talking minutes. Navigation systems are down. We have only manual flight controls. We're gonna check the rear panel. I can't get us up and running that fast. I don't even know how they got control of the plane. Talk to me, buddy, damn it! Flight deck, what's going on? This is the co-pilot. We need a medic. What's wrong? The captain cracked his head when the plane dropped. It's bad. He's unconscious. Repeat, the pilot is down. Is the plane under control? Shit. All the engines are dead. Trying to restart. I'm locked out of the navigation controls. Can you fly? Yes. I mean, no. 
I can try to keep it together manually, keep her in a glide, but I need another pilot. It takes two people to properly work the controls. Grace, check on the pilot. Where are you going? To get Colby. Try and get the backups online. Driver will access again. Pull the hard drives from the SMI and be ready to wipe them. Come on, Charlie. Hey, let me guess. We're totally fucked and I'm the only one who can unfuck us, right? The pilot's unconscious. Shit! Whatever the co-pilot? He's flying manually. I get it, it's a two-man job. Dump the power, kill the backup generator, reboot the system. Okay, I gotta get to the flight deck. Let me out of here, Fisher. Fisher, let me out of here. Take care of the power. Hey, dump some cargo while you're down there. It'll buy us some time. Briggs, head to the back of the plane. We need to lose cargo fast. On my way. on the flight recorder in case we don't make it. Sam, I got the cargo bay door open. Officer aboard aerial command center Collins. If you're listening to this message, please contact the local branch. Thank you. Have to stop the area We need to lose weight. Dump the chopper. Sure. 
We're gonna pump fuel back in the engines, all right? If I get this thing back online, we're gonna have seconds to fire it up. Manual fuel pump controls are in there. All right, once I reboot, you gotta pull back hard. Okay, we're gonna get one shot at this. Three, two, one, now! Oh, come on, come on, come on. Come on, you bitch, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up! Status. Main systems are back online. She's flying, but we're flying blind. Graham, internal comms work, but the other communication systems are still offline. Hey guys, what the hell just happened? We were hit with a Stuxnet-style virus. I rebooted the SMI from backup, did a full system scrub, we're clean. How did the engineers get a virus on my plane? We'll do the forensics and get you some answers. Oh shit. What now? It's a communique we received right before the plane went dark. The White House activated continuity of government. What does that mean? It means all the top military and government brass were sent to protected bunkers to make sure they survive. Last time that happened was 9-11. Oh my god. Do you think that last blacklist attack? I don't know that yet, Charlie. Just focus on restoring communications. Update on how we were hit with the virus. I'm buried with repairs. I gave Charlie point on that. You find anything? Nothing. That's not like him. He'd take a stab at a guess before he'd ever admit to not knowing something. Yeah, he seems off to me too. Thanks, Grim. I'll talk to you later. Leave a message after the tone, and I'll get back to you when I can. Thanks. Hey, Briggs. Any problems? Yeah. Suddenly, I don't think about throwing Colbin out the cargo bay door all the time. It's weird. First time for everything. Yeah, I guess even an asshole can be a hero sometimes. That's all for now. We'll talk later, Sam. Hey, Sam. How we doing, Charlie? Good. Yeah, I mean, fine, considering I had to roll the system back to before the virus. So you know the exact time we got hit? No. I mean, maybe. It's just hard to tell, you know? I'll follow up with Grim. That's all for now. Right. Yeah, I should get back to work anyway. saving your ass. You saved your own ass. We just happened to be on the same plane. After everything I've done for you, you still treat me like this. Ease up, Grandma. I'll still come visit. We're done here. Jesus, you're a downer. Would it kill you to let me be happy for like one minute?
want you to keep cycling the frequencies and don't stop until you get through, okay? Briggs, any word on that hijack ship? Outside communications are almost entirely blacked out. Can't sync up with anyone yet, but the crew's working on it. Charlie. The virus. I found the source. It was executed when we gutted the tablets and picked up a mirror. That's impossible. The system I is streamlined a couple of security protocols. I was just trying to boost operating speed. You let it infect the system? That's how they found us in Mexico. No, it wasn't. When we were on the ground, I contacted a former associate with the cartel. The engineers have a bounty out on us. He must have rolled on me for a cut. Charlie, why we're did you... The American fuel attack was successful. That must be why they activated continuity of government. What was the engineer's target? Sorry, Sam. Still getting flooded with intel. Got it. Looks like Louisiana, Sabine Pass, a natural gas tanker. Oh my god, Sabine Pass. That's the biggest fuel facility on the Gulf Coast. The engineers hit the facility with a computer virus right before the tanker hit. Security systems, fail safes, everything was disabled. The virus operates exactly like the one they hit our plane with. Oh shit. Every fuel facility on the coast has been infected. That fire spreads. They'll all go up one by one. refinery is not the place to go subtle. The SMI's optimal loadout is all about scouting with the tri-rotor and inflicting heavy damage with frags. You're not gonna pull the trigger. Stop pointing that thing at me. I'm here to help. Who said we needed help? Where did you come from? Off the books. They tasked you to secure the facility? They sent us to stop the fuel tanker, but they sent us too late. We got here after the crash, then tailed the squad of footmobiles. We almost got their leader, then everything went to shit. Grim, I got a high-value engineer target on the ground. Give me a location. It's gonna be okay.
Sam, hostiles are targeting the first responders. On my way. Grim, find me the lead engineer. As fast as I can. are burning out of control. You'll have to neutralize all the engineers before the emergency team can get back to work safely.
fires are burning out of control. You'll have to neutralize all the engineers before the emergency team can get back to work safely. Clear. 
You? Still hunting the lead engineer. Keep me posted. Chief, you're all clear. You make it get back to work. Thanks for the help. Should buy enough time to evacuate. There's got to be a way to stop this fire. Main gas line's dumping gas directly onto the fire. Spreads to the pipeline and blam! Might as well be pissing into the wind. How's he doing? We copy, Sam. Finding an exit for you now. No, I mean, wait. If you can find me a terminal, I can nuke the virus, clear their system. Chief, where's the control room? Top floor of the terminal building, but it's too dangerous. I'll be all right, I got backup. Good luck, Chief. Anyone need luck in this mess? It's you. If you can make the run to the terminal building, Sam, Charlie can shut the flow of gas down. into the engineer's combo on the terminal. You wanna listen? Pass me through.
stay sharp up there. The engineers are going to know we're here now. Got your back. Understood, Sam. Watch the east. I want updates by the minute. Go! Should have a visual on the leader now, Sam. Got him. Moving in. He's making a run for it. I'm after him.
Our accounts have been updated. Did we raise the president yet? Still trying. We've got an update on the SEAL team. They're all okay. We're gonna finish refueling, be back in the air in 20. Hey, appreciate your help back there. Yeah, thanks. You got a sec? Wait. It's nothing big. We'll catch you up later. Grim, the virus. Mexico, I gotta tell him. No, you don't. I screwed up. You think? Then why are you covering for me? I mean, why would you even want me here? I never did. Thanks. You asked. You don't listen to anyone. You think you know everything. You treat your work like a game. Are we done? No, we're not. You know what bothers me the most about you, Charlie? You're good at your job. The only thing standing between Sadiq and the world is this team. I can't afford to have Sam throwing you off this plane. I'm sorry. Then find a way to make it up to us.